Hi guys, my name is Claribel Guerra and welcome to Mob Crush in the Mix. We are showcasing games such as Fortnite on mobile and the newest FPS Shadow Gun Legends. We've gathered the best clips and your favorite moments from your favorite Mob Crush personalities and divided them up into three categories. Clutch comebacks, dominating performances and entertaining moments. Find out who made it on this week's list coming up next. Let's get the show started with our very first clip. We have the real Techie playing Fortnite on mobile and he's surrounded by the enemy and he's taking fire. Yet, play close attention to how he's playing the game. He's constantly moving, he's never standing still and he's very well aware of everything that's happening around him. Techie is making good use of his surroundings while he's getting shot at by missiles. His ally is also perfectly positioned sitting safely atop a hill and telling Techie the whereabouts of all of his enemies. He's even providing cover as needed. With this guidance, Techie's skill is more than enough to secure the victory. I know it's a little difficult to pay attention to, but always keep your surroundings in check. This is also a great example of when to listen to your teammates and great team synergy. Nice. Okay. All right. In our next clip, Jay-Z TNB turns up the heat with his finesse and bravery. He begins his commanding aggression by turning the tables on the enemy Alpha who attempted to turret dive him. Big mistake. Alpha gets heavily punished when Jay-Z TNB uses Saber's triple sweep, an ability that hits your opponents three times in a row that leaves one badly bruised if not dead. Remember that Purify is the only counter to triple sweep, but fortunately for Jay-Z, it wasn't used in this fight. He's not only able to win the top lane skirmish, but he also ventures to the mid lane in order to save his ally and pick up a very easy double kill. Oh, what the hell? I didn't expect to have double kill right there. I just decided to heal my friend. In our final clip, Danny0215 is seeking refuge in a shed with an ally in a game of Fortnite. He's recovering health points and hoping to lick his wounds before the next gun battle begins. However, the enemy knocks on the door and brings the gunfight to them. Danny makes a grand exit, spraying and praying his enemies with a machine gun in every single direction. His back was against the wall and he brought his A game to the table. He faces his fears, obtains two kills and heals his drop friend back to life and finally is able to harvest all of that sweet loot. Woohoo! He race quitted. Woo! Two kills, boy! I never thought I could actually get that. <laughs> the, that minigun came in clutch. Eagle Eye remains the bread and butter of Sing's arsenal. He keeps impressing us over and over again with his mechanical mastery of Arena of Valor's Talanis. This week is no different. He uses Eagle Eye in order to poke and chip down his opponent's HP before his trusty support crest goes in for the turret dive. Remember that Eagle Eye lets you deal consistent damage by increasing your range while staying safely away from your enemies. After a beautiful double kill, he goes on to siege another turret. Double kill! Your team has destroyed a tower! Mint City is staying fresh for the play that truly demonstrates a dominating performance. He ends up knocking two guys out of a moving buggy. Two guys in a moving car. Do you guys know how hard that is to do? Anyway, watch this. Oh, yeah. oh I see him, I see him. You know what's kind of weird? It's like sometimes... Oh, I just what knocked the them both! This was like a no scope. How oh, my oh my gosh! What the? Oh my that gosh, that's a highlight. You sure got lucky there, Mint. It's quite impressive to be able to knock people off of a moving vehicle, and I think at this point he's all reflexes. Later in the game, he goes on to kill off all of his opponents without breaking a sweat. Well, it might have been due to potential bots, but regardless, his teammate is in awe of his incredible killing spree. Mint ends up getting six kills and leaving us all rooting for him. Oh my god! How many kills? A great sign of an experienced player is that they do not hesitate and they know when to strike. Razmi Kio9 is one such player. He's able to locate and eliminate all of his enemies so quickly, it's absurd. Just look at how casually and confidently he targets and guns down his prey. It would seem like a near impossible task to defeat him in a team deathmatch and forward assault.
For our final clip, we're bringing you a little bit of Shadow Gun Legends. It's a new first-person shooter game that is out on iOS and Android, and it's easily a wonderfully made game, and it can be one of the best on mobile. Here we have Game Therapy taking out enemy after enemy. He misses a few times, but he quickly compensates with an enviable headshot. The graphics, atmosphere, and gameplay are pretty amazing for a mobile FPS. Be sure to check this game out. Ooh, headshot. I saw that. Sometimes you bite off more than you can chew, and pro Vainglory player Gabe Vizzle can testify to that being absolutely true. <gasps> I just rhymed. Yay me. Anyway, he overcalculates himself when he attempts to destroy a mid lane turret and finds himself being bombarded by a barrage of turret fire and offensive enemy abilities. However, he is able to repeatedly escape certain death with just a teensy bit of health left. When I saw this, I was like, run, Gabe, run. Don't you just love those days where nothing is going your way? When everything that could possibly go wrong does? Well, Lonely Ewok had one of those days due to this hilariously unfortunate clip. He begins his epic fail by missing almost every single shot he takes with his shotgun. The cringe continues when his opponent finally drops and Ewok is left out of bullets. He resorts to his pickaxe to finish the job but to no avail. He's slashing and thrashing and hacking at his enemy but is soon killed himself. Hard luck Ewok, you'll get them next time. <laughs> Alright, that was bad, that was bad. <laughs> The name Lucky Lukester does not ring true in this unlucky fail. In Pocket Minecraft, Lucky Lukester is playing a race and he's trying to get to a checkpoint, but instead he ends up celebrating a little too soon. Hey shit, there we go. That's right, that's right, that's right. <sighs> this is really stressful. He notices a cliffhanger from which he jumps all too eagerly. He's left underneath his path and wondering where he went wrong. Way to ruin a great run, Luke. No! Do I out? Do I have to jump back up? Oh, is this is a glitch. What the heck just happened? You've heard this story before. Potential for a great upset. Only an extraordinary genius play can save your team out of nowhere and against all odds. Our hero rises and Iraqi Zoro takes it upon himself to save the day. In a game of 5v5 of Vainglory, the enemy team is demolishing his base. He sees only one viable path to victory, teleporting into the opposing base and destroying the vein crystal himself. Does he make it? Find out on next week's episode. Nah, I'm kidding, guys. Just keep watching. <laughs> They're going for our base! Oh! oh, no! No, he didn't tell me! Look at the main crystal! No! Did you troll? I had my B up, and you didn't tell me! <laughs> I didn't no! Alrighty folks, that is all that I have for you this week. Let us know what you think of the show right to us. If you want to be featured on our show, all you have to do is send in the broadcast link, timestamps, and a short description as to why I should pick your amazing play to the email address below. And thank you so much for watching and I will catch you guys next week.